Hi friends, welcome to 30 Inks 30 Days Day 5, the one in which my phone holder is being held together by kitchen twine. So yeah, that's something. Anyway, let's look at yesterday, which was Kobe number 41, Suma Riku Rose. It is pretty. There is some um, sheen. Yeah, let's see, does that come through? Yeah, I think you're getting a little bit of, of a halo of sheen around the edges. I suspect that would not show up in the writing, but who knows? Um, I mean, this is a pretty heavy application with this. And maybe there's a faint halo around it. But that's yesterday. We're moving on to today. And we got a card. We got our Splatatron. Official name. Um, and we have Pilot Roshizuku Hana Ikada. Pink. <laughs> because of course it is this looks crooked I can't touch it I'm sorry if it's crooked but I if I'm not joking about the not joking about the kitchen twine <laughs> um maybe I can do this though. No, it's better anyway looking forward to this so and that might be a good amount. Hana Ikata. This one's pretty light. At first blush, it's a more orangey pink. Like in the pooling, it is definitely warmer than say Hope pink. Zoom. I probably should have zoomed earlier. Apologies for that. It's been a, been a, I've had better days than today was. I think it's time to burn this again. One mo. Okay, we burnt it. Yep. There's no way I got enough ink on here. I mean, there is a way. It's possible I did, but re-dipping anyway. How do you make an eye again? Anybody remember? I think that's it. Every time I write with this, I'm like, Ugh, I hate this paper. And you would think, well, then maybe stop. But I don't want to change my card just because I changed the texture of the paper. Instead, I'm just going to complain about it all the time. You know? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> but it's just, it is. It's so frustrating. It's, it's, it's a different product. You know, not the same thing. So, Iroshizuku, Ikara. Yeah, very warm to my eyes, pink in the pooling. Pull it out, it it looks slightly more neutral, but so I think 
you could imagine like that pulled out is how it's going to look in a pen but to me one of the things about swatching like this is it lets you see the more subtle characteristics so if i wanted to find a match for this for instance it might help me to see it this way to compare now there's still stuff in my brush so i think i'm going to do this with the brush i don't usually this is usually automatic pen territory but you know there we go in fact maybe since there's still some i don't even know if you saw that well i'll figure that out later You know, a good way to tell actually what it's made of. Let's do some, let's do some paper towel chrom chromatography, shall we? Oh, though, you know what? It's possible that this has some of yesterday's ink. Water. Mm, I'm seeing a halo of warmer color. Anyway. Wow. This looks textural. I know that's not today, but. Wow, wow, wow. So I'm going to get our Decoro dipped. Mm Mm-hmm. That's pretty. I bought all those other inks. Maybe I should just bought this one. <laughs> so let's do our hashtag. 30 inks. 30 days. September 2024. Day five, a little more ink from the nib. Ink. Pilot. Nero Shizu Ku. Sana. Doesn't say hand, okay? I caught up. Sailor. Okoro. Fude. And now, Splatitude. Did I already come up with the idea of like a Splatitude journal that's like a gratitude journal, but with, it's just full of splats? Or is this the first time I'm saying that? Let me know. I like the idea either way. But sometimes I find that um, apparently I've had the same great idea more than once. And each time I'm like, whoa, I just thought of this thing. Probably not great. I'm a bit young for that. <laughs> These things happen. Ooh. Okay. I folded these paper towels and that was, it seems, a mistake. 
Yeah, very warm. Based on something someone was saying, I expected it to be neutral. But hopefully you can see how peachy. Oh, that sounded dirty. So let's do the main, the calendar page in our, um, the weeks. And then I think I might compare this to some other ones. This is Connor. Uh, this is hard for me to write with because my natural writing angle is lower um, than that wants to go. And well, I mean, it's fine if I want to write with it as a food day, but for, for many of these applications, that would be the wrong thing. <laughs> the, uh, tiny grid on the Hobonichi does not really want a food a nib unless you're willing to take up multiple lines. <clears throat> In my opinion. So let's, since we have these here, is it close to any of these? So flamingo pink is definitely redder, warmer. Hope pink is more neutral, is more to the blue side. And actually I would put it kind of like this. One moment. Just kind of want to compare it to the pinks that I just bought. Okay, wait, these are all out of order now. Why does that matter? I don't know. So Kobe is more red by a lot. Sailor Shikiori Sakura Mori. Similar. I think this is more of a true pink. Less peach to my eye. Floating Cloud. Now we're headed slightly more blue. Abigail, right out. Tsutsuji. This to me also reads as more pink. Vibrant pink, red. This is a very warm pink. Interesting. Anyway, I hope you didn't mind that diversion. At the end of the month, I do plan on like laying out all the pinks and thinking about them some more. Does this have a 30? Um, just kind of looking at them and seeing what I think and so on as usual, but since these are all pinks, it'll be a little different, but here we are. So curious, do you have Hanekata? Do you also perceive it as a warmer pink? Like it is actually looking at um, some swatches on a website. It looked fairly close to Sailor Gentle Pesh. Um, slightly cooler, which is a definite, I mean, it's peach um, by name. At any rate, hope whenever you're watching this, you're having a wonderful day. Take care of yourselves. Bye.